With Season 20 of Apex Legends just around the corner and the new perk system being introduced, I just wanted to touch base on what this means for Octane as he is my main in Apex, and for anyone who doesn't know how the perk system is going to work right now, there are level 2 perks which are blue shields, and level 3 perks which are purple shields. And when you level up your shields in game, you can choose either one of the two perks per shield group, which I assume stays with you as you climb to red shields. So now that's out the way, let's dive into Octane's perks and what this could mean for him. So the first one out of the two perks you can choose from is Thick Skin, which gives Octane 25% less stim damage, which will make pushing fights in my opinion even better from not losing too much health. Not that this was much of a problem anyway for players who are experienced, but maybe more so for the inexperienced Octane players who stim a little too much going into fights. Also giving you that extra edge getting out of fights, this will definitely come in clutch and I'm excited to run this perk. The second perk out of the two you can choose from is Reckless, which means you'll receive 25% less explosive damage from the likes of Arc Stars and Grenades, but honestly, I've never had too much of a problem with getting hit by grenades, especially if you're aware of the direction they're exploding. So in my opinion, Thick Skin is definitely the best out of the two, but Reckless still being a viable option. But the true Octane mains I think will be running Thick Skin as we all want to go faster. Moving on now to level 3 shield perks, and the first one out of the two you can choose from is Aerial Agility, which gives Octane the ability to change directions on double jump, which for me is crazy as I'm a control player and have always wanted to be able to tap strafe. Even though it can be possible to tap strafe on controller with plenty of practice, I just think that this makes things that little bit easier, providing that you've just taken your jump pad. But either way, this will be a great addition to Octane's kit for getting rank corners quickly and catching your enemies off guard, getting into fights or out of them, and being more unpredictable in the air as sometimes you can be a sitting target while airborne in some situations. I'm excited to see how this plays in game and I'll also be seeing what's possible in the firing range. So last but not least is Mad Hops, which gives Octane the ability to save up two jump pads that he can use one after the other. This could be very very powerful if used properly, like getting you and your squad into the last two teams fighting on the map to secure that win quickly and out of nowhere, or just getting you and your squad the hell out of dodge in a bad situation. You can cover a lot of ground with just one jump pad, so the extra jump pad is the cherry on top even for making rotations or getting away from Storm if you've overstayed your welcome out of zone. There are many possible ways to use this perk and I'll definitely be giving it a try. I think that between Aerial Agility and Mad Hops, it's a really hard choice because both are very good and I'll have to play a few games with them to really give my best opinion, but as it stands, I actually think that I would go with Mad Hops as it's not only benefiting you, it benefits the whole team and as far as Apex goes for me, you can't do without your team. So guys, that concludes all of Octane's perks and my opinion on them, and I'm super excited for Season 20 to roll around so we can all give them a try. Like I said at the start, I chose Octane's perks as he is my main, but if anyone wants me to cover any of the legends, please let me know down in the comments. Also, if you're an Octane main, and you guys in general, which perks are you choosing for Octane? Let me know down in the comments as well. Now before I wrap this video up for anyone who is still watching, I'm hosting a community event on Apex Legends on Saturday the 10th of February, which is only a few days away now, where we will be jumping into a private BR game and the winning team will receive a gifted item each from the Apex Legends store. There will be private games after just for fun for anyone who wants to stick around and it would be great to get as many of you as possible on board. So if you want to get involved, all you have to do is subscribe with notifications on and join my community discord. Links down in the description and I will see you all there. Leave this video a like guys if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. Have a great day and I'll see you all next time.